and welcome to my Buster bedroom. So my bedroom, I wanted it to have a really lush, uh, still a bit of luxurious, um, but still a relaxing theme. So I also painted the walls a shade of light grey because I think that's really calming and soothing. Uh, so the main colour is still grey, so my wardrobe is in the same carpentry as the kitchen. So it's grey with black candles. So over here I have some shelvings and drawers to wear my dresses and skirts. So on top are like the winter clothing and the bags that I don't use this often. And over here I have my dresses. I don't know, I have my tops and like longer pants. Um, yeah, so I got matching bedside tables. I really wanted like um, glass ones. So, as you can tell from by now, I love marble. So, this marble white and the lights are also in Taobao. Yeah, so it comes with brass bowls. Um, accent, and so I also got all these lights with touch of gold from Taobao. So here I have a little tray for my bits and pieces and I don't know, I found this little cute um, artwork of Mademoiselle Chanel and my bed it is also has a grey headboard and I got this cushion just to match the headboard Yeah, so I'm saying the dry flowers and all this um, Accessories are from Taobao. <laughs> I, so Taobao has a lot of like marble and gold themed items. So this um, coat hang, this back hanger here is also from Taobao. And like the base is also solid marble. Yeah. So I just hang like my bags and skirts and um, so the curtains in this room also from Big Studios. So I went with like a blush pink, um, light pink theme. Um, so, because my whole room, I felt the grey colour was very masculine. So I wanted the room to be a bit more feminine. So I added like attachments of pink. And so I also have like day curtains. And I love having the curtains because it makes the room like really cozy. And um, yeah, it just feels very relaxing. So here is my bathroom. So I wanted it really relaxing as well. So I went with a dark theme. I wasn't sure about it at first, but um, I was happy with how it looks. So the door is black, and the tiles are like various shades of gray. We have a medium gray and a dark gray. And I managed to find like all these accessories, which are in black. So the tap wire here is also black again from Cola, a black soap dispenser, and this is a porcelain top um, vanity. So I went with a light timber um, for the carpentry, and there's a lot of storage space where I put my skincare. So this is like daytime, this is like nighttime, and these are all the moisturizers. Over here, I have my shower. Um, so, yeah, all these are mounted. Um, I got like steel ones, so they're very, very good quality and they don't rust. So, you go over here, you can look at this towel which we got. So, it's got some kind of texture on it, some kind of pattern. I don't know, it looks a bit glittery. So, you can see this towel and this towel is different. I love taking a shower here, it's so relaxing. I feel like I'm in a spa on the holiday. So that's like the theme of my bathroom. It's like, I want to look like a hotel bathroom. It's of art. It's coffee cup Sephora from Melbourne. I learned from a seller on Etsy. Basically have all the coffee cups from the different cafes in Paran. We love to make coffee for the city that loves to drink it. I miss love it so much. And um, so over here, I'm going to show you my office slash uh, marketing room. So 
I got this wrap from IKEA just to put like my workout clothes. So, so here I have my workout tops, like here are some of the jackets, and some of the bags, boxing. So I separated like here are my caps, and I have my leggings and shorts and like sports bras. I can literally open like um <laughs> sports wear shop. I've got a full length mirror here. I have my yoga mat and. Here I've got some more plants as well. So I got this plants from IKEA. IKEA has a really good selection of plants, so and they're really affordable to so the map. So in this room I decided to have um a Venetian blinds. So I went with black blinds with black page, like kind of a plastic um look. And I can show you the blinds, they are really easy to operate. They're also from Drake Studio as well. Okay, so you pull to this side and then go like that. Ta-da! I love the best way to it. And yeah, so this is how you control how much light you want in. It's not fully black out, but it still lets some light in. Yeah, and offer some privacy. Um, that's why I really like my mind. And here, so it's more, this room has more of a light. I want to have more of a holiday, tropical. Kind of buy it. So I have a picture of Palm Spring and I don't know some random on this beach. Okay, so here's my work, my work area. So I'm gonna like this cushion cover I got from Bali because I used to work in Bali. So this is like a little piece of Bali inspired space. I'm not sure. Yeah, so I just do my work here. So I got this table from. Star Living. Okay, so we, got, we got it from IKEA. This one that a white book paint and this one was really like affordable. So like, yeah. I don't have books at the moment, but I look forward to buying more books and reading more books. Hey guys, so this concludes the end of my house tour and I hope you enjoy it. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. See you in the next one!